Now let's go on to our sponsored video. Mermaid VR, which is basically cinema in VR, but the cinema is different location. It's hard to explain, I'll just show you. <laughs> Okay, so here we are in Mermaid VR. I actually, just before this, tested some things out so I didn't look too much like a twat doing this. <laughs> so here we are in the, um, there's, this is one of the locations. Basically, you can watch either stuff from the internet. There's the Mermaid VR website right there. Basically, you can browse the internet. You've got a nice keyboard down here. It's very, like, intuitive. It's, it's very clear and easy to do. You've even got a .com down there. There's Mermaid VR website. You can get to YouTube, Twitch, Netflix. I mean, let's go with YouTube, thing as my internet it's working oh here we go look, look at this so you can basically browse the internet in vr in multiple locations so it's a settings you've got language brightness saturation you can adjust all of these effort right, switch aspect ratio background this is where you can change what location you're in man so you can browse the internet in vr in a courtyard look at this nice little joint you got a garden which i think is uh is very zen blood this is proper zen blood where is this is this eject there's a pyramid there so if you want to browse the internet watch youtube videos and whatnot in vr chill out in a weird egyptian garden and do it or maybe in a house that's not like yours because it looks better if you've got a crap house you know Come here, watch YouTube videos on the big screen, mate. I'll show you something that I, one of my favorite things in this is, in a second, mate. Uh, you got island, just hover above pond, look and place. Is this in the sky? This is an island in the sky. <laughs> what the hell? Easy enough to scroll up and down. You just use this little, uh, little joystick there to go up and down. Oh, mate. Oh, this is going to be my one. Now I'm going to browse all my VR stuff. So you could even watch movies on that. I'll show you that, that in a minute. You can even watch movies on this big screen here. So imagine like just going, oh, oh fancy. Just for the hell of it. Watching Star Wars on a beach in India. <laughs> Wherever this is. You can do that. Maybe Tibet. Maybe you want to watch it in Tibet. There was that. Or maybe if you, uh, you're you not in the mood, you don't want any distractions from the movie, just choose black. Just hover in, in space with no stars and watch it, you know? What I'm going to go for, though, I'm going to go for uh, the seafloor because I just I love underwater stuff. How deep are we right now? You can also go to uh, downloadable content. You can download stuff. Here's your history, where you've been. Obviously, that's what history is all about, mate. Now, you can also, not only can you go to uh, websites and stuff, you go to local here. Look at this. Look at this. You can... Pick movies or videos to watch just off your hard drive. So I can't show you much of this because obviously it's not out yet and it's a sponsored video by Oculus. They'll have a go at me if I show you it. But look at that. Look at that. There's me. I'm watching me under the sea. <laughs> under the sea. So you can even watch your own YouTube videos through this if you're a narcissistic like I am. What does this do? Oh, oh this darkens it if you want it. Yeah, this because sometimes it's too bright. Like if it's a dark movie, you know, horror movie, switch that off. It darkens everything. Oh, beautiful. There you've got the volume. There you've got different, as not aspect ratio. Oh, I know the name of it. Or I know the smart name for this. You can have it flat. You can have a nice little curved TV. Have it 360. Not sure why you'd want to have, have it 360. Jesus Christ, I look tall. Kind of like that. Uh, you can have a 180 or you can also have it in a cinema. Yeah, boy. You can have it in a cinema. Look, there's me on the big screen. You can watch YouTube videos. Now, people watching this, because it's in 2D, you won't get why you would do this. But because in like VR... Oh, let me sit down a minute. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> in VR, because it's 3D and you get a sense of scale, this screen is absolutely massive. So you can, it actually feels like you're in a cinema. So if you want to watch even just one of your YouTube videos, make yourself look like a star like I have, you can do that. Why not, eh? Or if you've got a movie, like the new Star Wars movie or something, it's too big of a movie to just watch it on your TV. In the VR, man, you can watch it on the big screen. Look at that. Now, I found something cool to do. If you do that, if you click on this little thing here, you can actually choose a seat. Look at that. Uh, look at that. How cool is that? Sit right at the back, maybe, if you want a little smooch. Sit at the front, maybe, if you're an idiot. Who wants to sit at the front? No, no, no. About, about middle, mate. About middle. There we go. Look at that. Now, I had another cinema sort of VR thing I used to use. I think it was Oculus VR video, something like that. But it's, it hasn't got all of these controls. You can't pick seats. And you can't, like, be under the sea, I don't think, with it. <laughs> so it's a lot better for this. Uh, what's 2D do? Oh, that just changes... Ah, that changes the way you watch it, I see. My coolest things, I don't know why I find this so cool. But if you click this here, you can actually move this around. You can move it in and out if you're blind. Have it up close like that. Look at, oh, look how cool I look right there, man. You can do that. That resets it. You can actually, look, you can just move it around. I, just, I fancy having it over here, actually. Well, how about that? No, actually, I think I'll have it on the sea floor. Or maybe I want to watch myself up there. How cool is that? And also, you can do this, look. 
You can also shrink it and make it bigger. It's so, it's so smooth. I know I'm probably saying this a lot, but it's so intuitive and smooth. Look at that. Look. What other video thing can you find where you can just be like, actually, I want to watch it from this angle. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. All right, what else is there? Uh, what's this? Oh, this is where you can do settings and stuff, loop subtitles. Just look at me. Oh, looks so cool right there. Beautiful. Can't show too much. Can't show too much. This will be coming out on the 12th of February, I think. They, they made me do it, all right? I can't bring it any earlier. So It's so easy to get to stuff. Look, I just want it a bit smaller. There we go. It's like that. <laughs> if you fancy all of a sudden you're just like, oh, I don't want to be in the sea and watch my video. I'll just go to the courtyard. Look, I'll just watch myself in the courtyard. How about that? Oh, I don't want myself there. I want myself over here. Right next to the house. This is looking weird. This is. It's like having a giant big screen on your house. There we go. <laughs> just put it there. <laughs> you got so much freedom with this. That's I think that's why I like it so much. You've got you just got so much freedom. That's too big. There we go. Put that up there. there. Or in the tree. Now I'm in the tree. Look. Bloody awesome. One last thing as well. You've actually, I've just noticed you've got the controls on your hand. So you don't even have to click on that and press play. You can just do it through here. You've got the home buttons. You've got, you can up the volume on either controller. Down like that. Skip ahead, skip back. Anyway, thank you Mermaid VR for introducing me to this. This is definitely going to be my new number one spot to go to watch VR videos. And you can also, if you download 360 degree videos on YouTube, there is a setting where you can actually watch these and actually be in a VR video in this app too. Link below for Mermaid VR and Aircar. Both my free VR videos of the week. Or maybe every other week. I don't know how many times I'm going to do this. <laughs> Hopefully you enjoyed. Make sure to follow me on all these stocks. sites on the side of yet. Check down there if you want to help support me on Patreon. Check the bell below to get notifications on my latest videos. I'll see you in the next one, Vlad. Ciao.